you know, I love this show called Divorce Court. And, you know, the, the advices that the judges, the judge gives are very helpful. And it's just a reminder of how I don't want to find myself there, you know. So I have to adjust right now. So, um, the episode this morning, there was a girl who was like, um, she needs a ring, right? And the guy's like, he's not ready to get married. And, you know, I was very vexed watching the episode because I don't know why some men think they're doing a woman a favor by marrying her. You're not doing me any favor by getting married to me. You're doing yourself a favor by putting a ring on it. Now, in Genesis, when God created man and created evil, when he, Adam saw Eve, he said, this is now. The bone of my bones and flesh of my flesh. That's to say, when you know a woman is good for you and is yours, you know it now. Some people know it on the first day. Some people know it on the second day. Some people know it on the tenth. And some people still don't know it, even after they've been married for ten years. They're still trying to figure it out. There's nothing like, I have to be ready, ready, ready. I have to really, really... Please, 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 please. You're not doing me a favor by putting a ring on it. I see girls being proposed to and jumping like popcorn. Listen, you are doing that dude a favor because he who finds a good wife, a wife up, finds a good thing and obtains favor from God. His life will turn around after he's married a good woman that you are. His destiny will be transmogrified after marrying the good woman that you are. So men out there, you're not doing a good woman a favor by marrying her. You're doing yourself, yourself a, a favor by marrying her. You are the one that will receive the blessing that she is, receive the favor that she is, receive the grace that she is, and not the other way around. Not the other way around. Two years, three years into the relationship, it's normal. Even six months into the relationship, it's normal for the woman to ask, like, where are we going? That doesn't mean she's desperate. Listen, women are genetically formed different than men. We are wired to give birth. And we are wired to nurture. You, you, paru, shakata. Two people cannot work together unless they agree. If we are going into different directions, go your route. And I take mine. If I ask you, where are you, where are we going? It's because I want you to put a name on it. I say, if any woman asks you, where are we going? That doesn't mean she's so desperate for marriage as the word puts it out there. No, she, she has a crown that she wants to give to the king who is willing to honor her with marriage. She has a crown that she's willing to put on the head of that man who knows a man reacts like a man and not like a boy. How can you be drinking the milk and not buy the cow? You're stealing. That's what it is. It's very illegal. There's nothing like we have to uh, live together for this period of time to know if I can co bit with you. There's nothing like that. Adam saw her and he knew she was the one. So if you don't know she is the one, let her go. Let her find another man who will know she is the one. You're not doing any woman a favor by marrying her. You're doing your life a favor, your destiny a favor, your kid's destiny a favor. You think it's easy to have a good woman? 